come to the Maliha Archaeological Center. This is in Sharjah in the UAE. Let's go in and check it out. So I have come to this beautiful archaeological center in Sharjah and soon it's going to be our national day which is the UAE national day on 2nd December. So the ticket is 25 dirhams and we are going in and checking it out. Starting with hydrology, with outlets, and springs, mountains, gravel, basin. Starting with that, and the oryx. So, the oryx antelope, which is found typically in the UAE. Antelope and Oroch, absolutely my lovely camel, donkeys, and these are the minerals that are found usually in here. Moving on to geology, the basic geology, of course. Paleolithic period, Neolithic period, then comes the Bronze Age, Iron Age, the late Greek Islamic period. the Neolithic sites and the prehistoric conditions. Okay, this is very interesting. These are some primary foreign graveyard from the ancient people. Nice ornaments which I would love to try it. Just like this one. So I really like these a lot. 
So here we are talking about the grapes. Got some interesting artifacts here, some potteries. These are the bones, cup and metal hood which they used to use. These are the body soup face grapes. Some more beautiful artifacts and necklaces. cups and boxes which we still actually use it so they were very advanced they and they were so far-sighted they have made some really interesting artifacts and some necklaces and jewelry so now moving forward to the iron age from 400 Beautiful artifacts here, some nice bowls and on display ahead is the scenography of the Iron Age, rock shelter grave, it was of VHS 30 at Jabal Buhas, that's a local area in the UAE. with a deep well dug higher up above the cave where groundwater lay at a shallow depth. When the groundwater began to seep into the well shaft, the Farage builders started digging an almost horizontal tunnel in the direction of the cave. To remove the excavated dirt, they dug additional shafts. We don't know how they managed to make the shaft meet the tunnel or end at the desired location, but it would have required considerable skill. The excavated rubble can still be seen, piled in rings around each hole. This helps archaeologists identify ancient Falage systems. Now, this is very interesting because it's a tombstone. It has the bilingual inscription of Aramaic and ancient South Arabian script found in Maliha. So this is very interesting and very relevant. So this is the last section of this archaeological center, it is the pre-Islamic era or the period. After this, the Islamic period started in the UAE. So let's take a look around and find some interesting artifacts and things that they used to uh, have in their uh, daily life. So let's check it out. they used to have they started to use currency in the pre-islamic period so different kind of coins that they've showed and external connections
city of Maleha, which means that they were very, very advanced right from the pre-Islamic era. That's again another tomb. And the evolution that they went through, the settlement area, this is how it looked like. So, the civilization started right from the pre-Islamic period, as you can see it here. So, the commonly found animal is the camel. Uh, the riding positions, product, body parts. That's a jaw of a hybrid camel and different kind of hybridization. us to the end of this interesting archaeological center in Sharjah. So book your tickets and do check out and also for details check out the description below, like my channel and subscribe to it. Bye bye.